Right YouTube, it's uh, Wow Sly, aka M6CTP, aka Charlie Tango 941 and today is just a quick little video on anyone that's recently bought or bought in the past if this is the future um, if anyone's bought the uh, the UV5R, the TP um, on the left you'll see this, the old standard UV5R and the radio on the right is um, UV5R TP and for those other English speaking countries I know that the abbreviation for toilet paper is TP and uh, believe me this radio is not toilet paper um, it stands for triple power um, it's 2, 4 and 8 watts instead of uh, 2 and 4 watts or 5 and whatever um, yeah so I, I mean I use Chirp to program my UV5R um, used Chirp, I think, for the beginning, and tried the Baofeng, Baofeng, Spoofeng software a couple of times. Just didn't quite get on with it. Some things I did like about it, some things I didn't. So anyway, I, I mainly use Chirp because one program does everything. It does all the radios. Um, so, yeah, anyway, right, back on track. Um, I got this to program for someone else, plugged it into the computer, selected UV5R um, on, on Chirp, as you do. And I'm just loading that on the computer now. Again, I'm so disorganised, I should have had this already loaded. There it is. So, right, I plugged it in. And then top of the left screen, I went to download from radio. And, um, yeah, that was right, that was right. I tried UV5R. Uh, there is no UV5R TP. And I even actually downloaded the latest version, because this, again, is a little bit old, this software. So I downloaded the latest firmware. And still there's no TP on there, UV5R TP, none existo. So I thought, right, I'm going to have to go down these one by one until I find the one I need, because I've done this a while ago. I think it was a, a TYT handset I used for someone, and it came under like F11 or something like that, I don't know. But uh, the other handset I was going to program for someone, they told me it was a Baofeng, and then uh, when I got it home, it didn't say Baofeng on it, it said something else. I don't know what it was, so I just went down these one at a time. So anyway, this UV5R TP, when you program it, is the BF-F8HP. Um, the Bravo Foxtrot-Foxtrot 8 Hotel Papa. Um, yeah, so when you've selected that, you can then upload and download to the radio. Uh, unlike me, you started flapping about the firmware not working or the lead had broken or the program had not been you know been corrupt so I started reinstalling the program I tried about three times to uh, click UV5R and then and then clone I think it's clone the actual button no okay tried click okay it just kept saying wrong model selected so I started freaking out and I think the fourth attempt I clicked BFF8 HP and it worked so uh, if you've got the UV5R TP and you can't get it to work with the UV5R program don't panic don't deinstall the program and reinstall the latest firmware and start checking the USB ports are working um, it's literally it's the BF-F8HP and that will get your radio programmed um, just to save any, anyone wasting time like I did last night right thanks for watching 73 for now this is Wow Sly, and that's the UV5R and the UV5R TP. Again, identical radios apart from different colour there. Everything's the same. Um, even the stickers at the bottom, these are the same. Even like the ID 2012 FP1942. The numbers down the bottom are the same. Uh, 0678, yeah, all the numbers, all the numbers are the same. All those made, radios are made years and years apart. Um, slightly different belt clips. Yeah. Right, thanks for watching. I hope that helps someone out. And we'll catch you on the next video. Ta da. I mean, sorry, 73 for now. <laughs>